Hi, I'm Melissa from Sobilytics, and my feature focus choice for today is key driver analysis. We all love metric questions like this. How satisfied are you with your recent experience? But we also have a follow-up question in mind, such as, how can we make it better? Or what made it so great? In some cases, you might choose to ask a follow-up question. That's an open-ended question like this. How could it be improved? Happy to hear, for example, as a follow-up to NPS. But perhaps for satisfaction, you'd like to drill down on why by asking more measurable metric type questions. Focusing in here, we see the key driver question type, which no surprise is going to be used in the key driver analysis report. This question type asks you to identify a few variables that you think may be impactful on your participants, your, in this case, members' visits to their credit union, and how their experience was affected by each of those variables. Now, ask the questions, and then once you get the answers, we can start to take a look at the report itself. Once we have, of course, all of our data in, we run those results, we can look at it in any number of reports, but today we're looking at specifically key driver analysis. Key driver analysis here we see, no running at all, it's automatically generated for me. So when I get down here, I can see that I'm looking at the relationship or potential relationships between the key driver analysis grid questions, and in this case, NPS. Now I might choose, I really care about satisfaction in the survey because those are the ones um, that I was really focusing on in terms of someone's satisfaction with their experience in my branch. Now, simple enough, dots down here. Which dots matter most? No kidding, it's the red one that you want to pay attention to. When you see something up here in the top left corner, this is indicating that this is an important weakness, meaning it's not going well, and it does have a significant impact on that metric that you're looking at. That is satisfaction. You can see the details down here below. Color pattern really breaks it down. Weaknesses, strengths. Down here, unimportant strengths. These things are going well, but not having any other impact. And so we can let them rest for now. So if I found one thing that I can do to improve the satisfaction of people who are visiting my credit union, it's ensuring my team is a little bit friendlier when they come in. We love key driver analysis because it helps us figure out why behind the rating, which of course gives us the opportunity to figure out what can we do to make it better in the future. Hope this has been a good experience for you too as well. Take care. Talk to you soon. Cheers.